Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. Done when she was sentenced to four years in federal prison today. Now she admits shooting her husband after learning of allegations he was abusing children in their care. WJZ investigator Mike Helgen is live with what is next and the outrage in the courtroom today. Mike. Denise Vick, Shantari Weems' lawyer tells us he'll do what he can to get her sentence modified, but there's no guarantee. A number of supporters believe justice was not served. They thought she would just walk out of court today a free woman. The judge said, no way. I just can't imagine. I, I did, no one expected this. Four years is, no one expected that. Outrage after a judge sentenced Baltimore County daycare owner Shantari Weems to four years in prison for shooting her husband after learning he molested children. Danita Wallace is Weems' childhood friend. Just to think about being in that scenario, the level of rage, what would you do? What would anybody do? I'm not saying that you're supposed to take the law into your own hands, but I cannot begin to imagine when. The person that you trust most in the world has not only violated your trust, has destroyed your business, and also violated children. Weems, a former correctional officer who lives in Randallstown, ran Little Kids Castle in Owings Mills. Her husband, James Weems, is a former Baltimore City police officer. She said she thought of him as her protector and never imagined he would abuse vulnerable children at her daycare. When she learned of the allegations, she drove to the Mandarin Oriental Hotel in Washington, D.C. last July, where he was staying while working on a private security detail, and shot him twice. I really thought time served was more than enough, and I cannot believe this judge did not accept even the plea deal that was offered by the government. When does this happen? It's really outrageous. D.C. Judge Michael O'Keefe sentenced Weems to double what prosecutors had asked for as part of a guilty plea, calling her actions cruel and the deal too lenient. Tony Garcia is Shantari Weems' lawyer. To get that kind of sentence is frankly to me, uh, it's, it's insulting. It, it simply doesn't make sense at all. Now, James Weems remains jailed in Baltimore County. His trial is set for late May. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.